Okay, so this man does not need to say a single word. The sight of him is terrifying enough. We're talking about Michael Myers from the Halloween movies, and this morning we're unmasking him, so to speak. Joining us now is Mr. James Jude Courtney. He plays the murderous Michael Myers in the recently released Halloween film. I don't know if you've been sensed that I was not even watching that clip, but just play. I, <laughs> I was not. Funny. I know better. And yet for your kids are digging it. Mm -mm -mm. Can, and, but, but by the way, can I tell you, if, if, if I didn't know of you, like the, the Mr. Courtney that plays Mike Myers, I would not even be here to do this interview, just so you know. But you're, you're, you're proof that some of the greatest villains are played by some of the nicest guys, I think. Uh, thank you. I, I, my, one of my idols is uh, Basil Rathbone, who it was notorious oh. for being one of the kindest men, you know, in, in, uh, in, in the movies, but he was playing baddies all the time. Hmm, as you're speaking, as they took a, 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 a wide shot of you. I was like, ooh, because the mask, I saw the mask. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a hero mask. That's what I wore in the uh, 2018 Halloween. Oh, my goodness. So this journey for you started in the 2018 Halloween. Now you did Halloween Kills. Oh, oh my goodness. Seriously, people? <laughs> this is... Uh, I should have had an ambulance in the plaza. Sorry, sir. <laughs> Everyone's here is crazy. But, but now... But, but the journey is not ending for you because we have the ending to the trilogy, correct? That's right, yeah. We're shooting Halloween Ends actually in January. It'll come out October uh, 2022. All right, so what is this what is this Halloween season like for you? Because this, the, Michael Myers is Halloween. He defines the whole, I guess, the day, the event that is. So what is it like? What do you do as Mr. Courtney? Uh, this, I mean, it's been nonstop. Uh, promotions, conventions, signing autographs, the premiere. It's been two months of this. It'll be probably another half a month, and then I'll get a chance to, to, to rest. I'm training hard, I'm dieting, and then we start shooting in January. Okay, so, but, but wait. So you don't, do you, you don't, you've never, like, dressed up for Halloween or anything in the past, even as a kid? Like, what did you do? Like, maybe as an adult, you don't. Um, not as an adult, I haven't for quite a while. But uh, maybe a little while ago, but mostly, like, pirates and, you know, that kind of thing. Um, never as a horror character. And certainly, since I'm playing this role, I would never, I don't put that mask on. You don't want to. You don't want to know me when I have that mask on. Something happens inside. It's I, not me. Because you have to go to a dark place to play that dude. It's true. Uh, in fact, David Gordon Green told me that he'd only worked with one other actor who had gone as deep as I go when I play Michael Myers, and he said that guy ended up on a psych ward for two months. He had a psychotic what? break. So, so what do you do, like, in between takes, though? Or do you stay in character? Do you go to lunch with the people at, like, commissary with the mask on? Or do you take off your mask? I'm covering my face because of Well, when the mask, when I go into character, I breathe it in, and then it's not me. I have no thoughts. I'm, I am not me. But then when I hear check the gate, that means we've shot all we're going to shoot for that particular setup. Then I breathe it out. Literally, I breathe it out. I, I let it out of my body, and then I become me again. So it's a technique I learned from, from years and years. I've done shamanic work in South America and Africa and, you know, in, in North America with Native American Indians, um, Native, you know, First Nations people. So there's a lot, there's a well-worn path of being able to go to dark places. And, and that's what I inhabit when I play this role. Mm, okay, so I, would, would, it, would it be safe to say that you're, okay, I just want to, they were showing you earlier, well, they were showing your character earlier. Uh, would it be safe to say that you're a fan of horror movies? Because clearly I can't, I would watch it, but I would not have my eyes or ears open. I'll be there. Oh, man, of course. I mean, like, when I saw the 1978 Halloween, I was in college, I brought a date. I can't even remember what her name is. I kind of remember what she looked like, but... I walked out of that film and I knew it was a game changer. I knew there was something special going on. And flash forward to 2018, Nick Castle, who played the original Michael Myers, he came in and did a cameo. And we were hoping we'd get a, 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 a passing of the torch or passing of the mask. And we did, we inhabited the exact same scene. And so flash forward to Halloween Kills, he's not in the movie physically, he's not in any of the scenes. But when I'm stalking people and you hear breathing, it's Nick Castle's breathing. So the spirit of what Nick Castle created in 1978 
lives through me wow. as I stalk my prey in Halloween Kills. Oh my God, I stalk people all the time, but not like Michael Myers does, I gotta say. But um, let me just say, I know you, since you love horror movies and you don't dress up for Halloween, what are your thoughts on Halloween candy or any kind of candy? I just tried some today. Oh, well, I candy corn's my you. favorite. Candy. I mean, candy corn, I'm Ooh. a sucker for candy corn. Me too, I love candy corn too. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, I knew we had something in common, sir. Yeah, that something... good looks too, right? Oh. <laughs> I wish, I wish, I wish. See you slick too. Thank you so much, Mr. Courtney. You have to come back for uh, when you're done with Hall the, the, the final Halloween then, Halloween. Oh, Halloween. I'd love to, I'd love to. You promise? It's I promise. I okay. Promise. It's going to be amazing. All right. Just like he promised it's going to be amazing when he returns, we promise it's going to be amazing when you check him out in Halloween Kills, which is currently in theaters and streaming on Peacock. Thank you so much, sir. Such a pleasure to meet you. Oh, it's so much fun. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween to you. Woo. Oh, sorry. I was trying to scare you. <laughs> Thanks.